Hi everybody, thank you very much for stopping by. Today I want to show you a quick tutorial on how I achieve my bantu nuts. As you can see, or maybe you can't see this too well, but I'm having a bad hair day. Anyway, first of all you need a spray bottle with water or whatever mixture you've got in your spritz bottle. Uh, please check the info box to see what I have in my spray bottle. After that you'll need a comb, then you'll need a wrap set mousse and a gel. You can use whatever gel you like but today I'm trying this um, Ampro clear eyes for the first time so I'm hoping for great results. Okay so right now I'm just uh, making a small section you know I want to have them really neat so I'll try my best to get them as neat as possible as this is gonna be my uh, protective hairstyle for the week. So that's my section. And now using the comb I'll detangle my hair, you know that small section. Next thing I'll need is the wrap mousse. So I'll take about this amount and this will be enough for that small section of hair. Now I just want to make sure that I coat the section of hair with a mousse. I'll then detangle again using my comb and as you can see the mousse has made my hair really soft. And now it's time for the gel. I'll take about this amount and uh, just apply it all over that section of hair. I added a tiny bit more of the gel, you know, and then um, I'll use my comb again to comb through, make sure it's fully detangled because I want to also wear this uh, hair in Bantu knot out and so that's why it has to be really soft. Okay, so I'm now making a two-strand twist. For bantu knots, there are two types of bantu knots. There is one with a two-strand twist and the other one without a two-strand twist. So I'll show you both of them. I'm done making the twist. You can see I didn't go all the way to the tip. Now it's time to make the knot. I'm coiling the hair, more like a finger coil, but don't make it too tight because it's gonna get tighter. And now I'm wrapping the, co the coiled hair around the root part. And so I'll wrap it around until I have a tiny bit and then the tiny bit I will just tack it in there. That's it. section I'll show you how to make the normal bantu knot the one that you don't need a two strand twist so I'll just repeat the same uh, process and now I'll go ahead and coil the hair around my index finger and once again, don't make it too tight because it's going to get tighter once we start making the knot. So um, I'll go all the way to the tip and then I start wrapping the hair around, um, around the root. And once I get to the tip, I tuck it um, down the root. 
and that's it. <laughs>this one took me about 15 minutes now the end result I am so in love with this hairstyle <laughs> uh, you can see there is some whitish stuff that's from the gel it dries with time you know like you can see the first part is already completely dried so I just have that middle part and I'll be done. So that's it guys. That's my Bantu Knot tutorial. I hope this was helpful. See you in my next video. Stay blessed. Bye-bye.